Sea monkeys, Jillian. Sea monkeys. What? Sea monkeys. Sea monkeys. Sea monkeys. Where are you going with this? Sea monkeys. Oh, oh, ocean apes. Not ocean apes, Jillian. Sea monkeys. What about sea monkeys? No, today's the day the sea monkeys are coming. Oh no, I always knew this is how the world was going to end. No, the pet sea monkeys that I ordered are arriving today, Jillian. Instant life. Instant life. Oh, that's a scam. They're just brine shrimp. Nuh-uh, these are sea monkeys. I hardly think they can sell brine shrimp and call them sea monkeys. Well, when are the alleged sea monkeys arriving? Wow, that was good timing. It's almost as if it was scripted. Oh, the sea monkeys are here! Hooray. Wow, the box is a lot bigger than it looked in the ad. Never mind, let's go find those delightful little sea monkeys. Are you a sea monkey? Ah, oh, there's been a mix up! Jillian, Jillian, Jillian! Oh, Jillian. I'm right here. They didn't send a sea monkey, Jillian. They sent some kind of monster. What? A monster in our house? Who'd have thunk it? I know, right? Wait a minute. I get the feeling you don't believe me. I don't believe you, but I'll play along. What do you want me to do? Go down the hallway and you'll find a box. In that box, there's a monster. It may be a monkey, but I don't think it's a sea monkey. I hope I'm not sending her off to her doom. Eh. It does seem like a pretty big box for sea monkeys. Hmm. Hey, Addy, there aren't any sea monkeys in here. Yeah! Sea monkeys? Is that you? Ah! It is a giant monkey! Addy, your sea monkey! It tried to get me! What I don't get is why they would send a monster instead of some sea monkey eggs. Maybe the box got wet and the eggs hatched on their own. So they had a monster egg instead of sea monkey eggs? Maybe there were other sea monkeys, but he ate all the other sea monkeys and he got big. I didn't realize sea monkeys were so monkey-like. Maybe it's just not as noticeable when they're small. Jillian, since he ate all the other sea monkeys, do you think he'll be looking for something else to eat now? Just go and explain the situation to him, and I'm sure he'll find one of the many fine restaurants in our area. No, Jillian, he'll just try to eat us. Ooh, ooh, I know. We'll just scare him away with salt water. Can we not use salt water in a video? Like, once? Yeah, I guess it wouldn't work anyway. They are brine shrimp. And what's a shrimp afraid of? Ooh, I know, a bed of steamed rice. You're gonna try to scare away a six foot tall monster with a bed of rice. Every time I eat shrimp, they're on a bed of rice. They have to have a negative association with the stuff. Well, using your seafood logic, I can spray them with this lemon juice. Well, lime, it's all we had. I think we're pretty well equipped to fight off a monster now. We do somehow manage to survive every week. All right, you giant monkey-like crustacean. You see this? He doesn't seem convinced, Daddy. Show him the lemon juice. It's lime juice. He doesn't know that yet. Ow, I got some in my paper cut. Just threaten him with it. Ooh, we got Ooh. rice. We got lime juice. What are you going to do about it? Ooh. Ah, he's, he's not impressed with
with grocery items. Man, who'd have thought that rice wouldn't scare away a monster? So what should we do, Jillian? Addy, I'm starting to think that this isn't a sea creature at all. Well, what is it? There's a movie called Creep Show where there's a crate monster. Is this the same crate monster? Eh, the one in the movie's a lot better quality. Well, in the movie, where did the crate monster come from? He was created by special effects makeup maestro Tom Savini. Jillian, you're a genius! Tom Savini can help us! I think he's got a pretty busy schedule. What are you talking about? We run into him all the time. We even saw him in Target with a plastic skeleton in his shopping cart. True story. And he did autograph Dad's copy of Creepshow. Hey, maybe if we show this crate monster Tom Savini's autograph, he'll realize how connected we are to his creator. Yeah, this sounds like a bit of a stretch, but I guess it's worth a try. I guess we have to walk past the box. Whatever you do, don't think about him reaching out and grabbing you while you walk by. Gee, thanks. Here it is! I thought this was his Tom Savini autograph. He autographed this poster too! How many Tom Savini autographs does Dad need? Just bring the DVD. Hey, George Romero signed this too! Stay scared? I thought that was our slogan! Great monster, we have something to show you! You see that? That's Tom Savini's autograph! He brought you into this world, and he can take you out! Ah! The monster has turned on its creator! You know, Jillian, I'm not big on watching movies. What did the crate monster do in this one? He ate three people. Ugh. Well, well, after that, what happened? After eating, he kind of calmed down. He went back in the crate and they sealed it up. Okay, so we just need to round up three people willing to help us. And by help us, you mean sacrifice their lives? Well, if you put it that way, no one's gonna volunteer. Can we have a solution that doesn't involve human sacrifice? Uh, I'm so tired of you saying that every week. Maybe he doesn't have to eat humans. Maybe he could eat... Rice? Yeah, the rice thing didn't work. You got anything chewy? You know, something that'll keep him busy for a while? Ooh, I still have these left over from Halloween. They should be nice and chewy. Wait, is this a sponsored video? Yes, it's a sponsored video with a giant monkey in a box and Swedish fish are gonna save the day seven minutes into the video. Well, as long as I get my cut. Hey, you! What's his name? His name is Fluffy the Crate Monster. Fluffy the Crate Monster, okay. Really? Yeah, really. Hey, Fluffy the Crate Monster. We know we got off on the wrong foot, so we got you something. Have some tasty Swedish fish. He's going back in the crate. Come on. This end's latched shut. We're good to go. Ooh, I think he's getting suspicious. Let's call the delivery service. Addy, text the sea monkey company and tell them you want to make a return. Already done. They'll be taking it back to Sea Monkey Headquarters today. Won't the monster just eat them when they open the box? They should have thought of that before they sent it to me. Wow, that's quick delivery pickup. 
I guess he's their problem now. We better look just in case. They traded out the big box for a small one. Ooh, I bet it's my sea monkeys. I guess that other box had nothing to do with the good folks at Sea Monkeys International. Wait, so who sent the big box? Tom Savini! What? Get him! Oh. Buy our merch, buy our merch. There's so many, we've got plenty, buy our merch. If you like Jillian and Natty videos, you're gonna love our merch. With a wide variety of products and designs, there's something for everyone. Just click on the links below, and they'll take you to our Teespring store. Or just go to JillianandAddy.com. It's all good. So that was Creepshow Crate Monster. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. Be sure to check out our other two channels. There's Jillian and Addy, our main channel, and Jillian and Addy Life, our vlogging channel. They're a lot of fun. Tell us what you thought about this video on Instagram. We also post new pictures, videos, and stories most every day. We even post sneak previews of our upcoming videos like this one. And remember, stay scared. Bye! I raised my hand to <laughs> It's never too soon to raise goodbye. That's, that's sad. It sounds yeah. like a song. Yeah, it sounds it's like a song too. <laughs>